Hey everybody, I'm Jeff Baker and welcome to This Is What I'm Talking About. Today I'm talking about Hawaiian Loco Moco. I had never heard of this before, I don't know if you have or not, but evidently it's a staple in Hawaiian food. So to get started, we're going to go with hamburger patty I've already made up. And to just make this a little bit unique, I've added some mesquite seasoning to the hamburger. We're just going to fry this up. We're also at the same time going to start some gravy. This is just a jar of gravy, jar of beef gravy. Go ahead. The fire already turned on there. Fortunately, it was on low. <laughs> That's a good one. And to make that unique, I'm going to add a little bit of mesquite flavoring to the gravy also. Just to make it a little bit different. We don't want this hamburger to be cooked all the way down. We actually want it medium rare the way this the way this comes out. This is going to be pretty quick. It won't take long at all. Just say Hawaiian loco moco. It's evidently it's served in uh, most restaurants and cafes and mom and pop shops all through Hawaii. We melt some butter here. Now we're going to put some onions in. Saute some onions. I'm making much more than these because I'm going to make make up two or three dishes so I can eat later in the in the week for myself. You don't need nearly this much if you're just making it for one or two people. But that's the way I eat during the week. Hawaiian Loco Moco. Don't know where it came from. Just know it's definitely very, very popular in Hawaii. Let's see, all we're doing is sauteing some onions, making up some gravy, and hamburger. We're also going to have, we're going to have rice that's going to go with this also. And you know how I like the minute rice. Here, just like this. This is much better than this. Peel this thing open. Stick in the microwave for one minute, you got perfect rice. No better way to do it. We don't want that hamburger all the way down. I know some might think that's gross, but trust me, it's the best way to do it. I like my hamburgers like that normally anyway, but this recipe actually calls for medium rare hamburgers. So I was happy to oblige. I'm hoping I get this thing done in 15 minutes to be able to upload it to Facebook. YouTube, I can do longer videos, but to get it to Facebook, it has to be 15 minutes or less. Like I said, we also got an egg going into this equation, too. Rice is perfectly done. So what we're going to do... Rice actually goes on the plate first, so... I'll put that on there. I'm 
made that hamburger pretty thick. I probably could have made it much thinner to go faster. And you're also going to want your onion done more than what this is going to be just due to time, time restraints. Anyway, we're going to pull this hamburger up here now. And we're going to put it right on top of the rice. you would want your onions caramelized more. But due to a time restraint, we're just going to put a few of them on here the way they are. You can pretty much get the idea. This is about the way you would like it with liver and onions. I mean, just think about that. Just the thought of this. Doesn't that sound good? Then, we're going to pour on some of our gravy with the mesquite flavoring added to it. I think this isn't looking good, folks. This thing has got to taste awesome. But we're not done yet. Now, on top of all that, We're actually going to do an egg. Actually, want the egg probably over easy, maybe. I personally like them sunny side up, but that's a personal preference. I mean, doesn't that look perfect already? I mean, wow. And I didn't realize having the, having the fire on when I put that gravy in. I got gravy all over my back of my stove, the back wall, the oven. Does that not look awesome? So what we're going to do Cut us a little bit of that. Oh, oh yeah. Cut that yolk and the medium rare hamburger and the onions. That's what I'm talking about. Is that gorgeous or what? Oh yeah, I'm gonna try it. A little bit of the egg, a little bit of the hamburger, a little rice, and this dude's gonna be hot. really glad I saw the cooking show that this was on. It was on a local cooking show here in San Diego and it, man, it's awesome. Very easy to make. Folks, try this out. You're, you're going to love this. Talking rice, hamburger patty, onions, gravy, egg. Perfect. And now I can tell my friends and family, les c'est les bon temps roulés. Let the good times roll. I'm getting ready to eat me some Hawaiian loco moco and that's what I'm talking about. 